What's cracking in an it? Well, guess what? Just from yesterday to today, um, I got an interview at Dick Sporting Goods, and it's on Monday, so I'm pretty jacked about that because yesterday I was talking about it. I'd already applied, um, like earlier in the week, and I spoke to a recruiter and all this stuff, but. Uh, they called me back just a few minutes ago, and I have an interview, so there could be a job on the horizon. Things could be changing for the better. I got a haircut. Y'all like it? Yeah. She actually did a really good job. I told her what I wanted, how, you know, how I wear it, and she actually did it. A lot of times I'll tell them, and it's like they go off on their own little thing and do whatever. I can't stand that. There's nothing worse than a bad haircut. Fellas, ladies, can you feel me? Nothing worse than a bad haircut. So, yeah, I'm pretty jacked about the whole job thing. I'm kind of, kind of gets me excited a little bit just for the simple fact that, you know, I'm a sports nut. So there's nothing, I mean, blah, blah, blah. there's nothing that, you know, dealing with sports in any way at all that it, I wouldn't absolutely just love. So, um, I'm like a sports junkie. There's not too much in anything about sports, any sports for that matter. I keep tabs on everything, so I have enough to talk about on everything, and I follow a few big things very, very heavy. So, yeah, I know it's not a huge job, but, you know, it's a job, and nowadays you take basically what you can get, and not that I would just be settling for that, but I would enjoy something like that, I believe. So, um, you all uh, keep that in your prayers. Hopefully, you know, we're willing it'll play out, and it will be what you know I hope for it to be you know a decent little job that'll bring in some money help us out some and we can stop putting so much wear and tear on our vehicle um, to make a buck you know by the way that's where I'm headed right now <laughs> I'm all way out here to do delivery for the catering company which by the way is victorious catering and if you have a wedding reception or a party or you just want an awesome lunch or dinner um, you know, for some special event of whatnot, then you need to call Victorious Catering. Uh, check it up or check it out. Look it up online. Um, don't have the number right with me, but um, food is awesome, and I know they do good work. So I wouldn't refer them or recommend them if they weren't quality. And I've known them for years and years and years, and they they're good at what they do. So Vicky's great. Uh, I love when people look at me when I'm vlogging. They're like, dude. He's holding the camera, talking to himself. Well, that's kind of what I'd like to do. Internet, talk to me. I know the videos have been kind of sporadic, but I'm gonna get back on track as soon as I get my computer. I'm, I'm actually feeling really comfortable with the, the way I've been doing these videos with my iPhone 4 because being that the flip is kind of going obsolete, uh, I really, I'm enjoying my iPhone 4 doing like it's so easy to, to edit and to you know, make quick little vlog videos and do stuff like this because it's right there on the phone. I can edit it. I can turn right around and upload it straight to YouTube and boom, it's done. The thing I got to get used to is not looking at myself and looking at the camera. <laughs> uh, it's kind of hard to do when you're kind of used to just looking at the screen, but whatever. Uh, so that's what my day's gotten up and is going to entail. I did get to go in the Apple store yesterday and get, they replaced my headphones. They were freaking awesome as usual. No questions asked. They just, what kind of phone you have? I said iPhone 4. They're like, boom, here you go. Yeah, I'm on my way. It's that simple. So, uh, hope everybody's having a great day out there in the internet world. And if you're watching this, thank you very much. Please continue to watch. I know there's not a ton of viewers on here, but the one or two or three or four that do get to watch regularly is genuinely genuinely appreciative appreciated so um, I just want to say thank you you know I know y'all don't have to take the time out of your day to do it but to watch but you do and that means something to me and that's the only reason why I make these videos is because I know that y'all are watching and you know it might be I might every once in a while say something that might help somebody or be therapeutic not only for me but for somebody else you never know you know I mean, heck, we're just talking to ourselves. I mean, really. <laughs> what? 
what's the harm in that? I mean, <laughs> all right, y'all. Love y'all. Peace. funny. It's two squirrels. I just caught the tail end of it, but for like five minutes they were chasing each other around this tree in front of my front yard. Just going back and forth, back and forth. That was hilarious. What's up, internet? I've got a lot on my mind. So, my oldest son, Austin, is a junior this year. He's going to have his ring ceremony next Friday for school. Gets his class ring. Um, can y'all see me? Oh, here we go. Gets his class ring. And um, he's also the vice president. He wants to go in the Air Force. Air Force. Uh, wanted to go in the Marines and I understand the the draw of the Marine Corps just as good as anybody but uh, his godfather, my best friend and brother from another mother, mother Lieutenant Colonel Ron Hopkins aka Hoppy <laughs> he is uh, in the Air Force um, he's in Afghanistan right now He'll be coming home soon, Lord willing. And I'll have him, you know, talk to uh, talk to Austin also. But we're going to go and talk to a recruiter. He's been practicing, studying on his ASVAB. He does pretty good. He needs to do some more studying and really get it down. Uh, but I'd be, I would be totally fine with him going to the military, especially the Air Force. They take care of their people. All the branches take care of their people, but... Just like a job, some jobs take care more, take a little bit better care than other jobs, you know, take care of their employees. So, um, that's the way I feel about the Air Force. Um, my friend Ronnie has made a good life in the Air Force, and I feel that Austin could do the same thing as long as he keeps his head on straight and, you know, does what he wants to do and works hard. Um, not necessarily, don't know if he wants to go in. You know, he's gonna go, he wants to do active duty, but he doesn't know if he wants to do, you know, kind of a, a lifer, I guess you'd say. He wants to actually be an MP and then try to come out and be a cop. Um, it's a proud thing, you know, I'm proud of him. At the same time, you know, I know what the world is like today. And that makes me nervous because... Regardless of what branch you're in, you're liable to see action somewhere doing something. So, uh, I hope and pray that if it's meant for him to go into the military, that it all works out and it's all good. And if it's not, that God would put up a brick wall and make it abundantly clear to us to not pursue it. And for him not to pursue it and let him know that, you know, it's his decision, not ours. We're going to give him valuable real-life input, and so will his you know, godfather. And uh, that's about it. I'm just chilling, literally. I'm tired. 
have a headache. And yes, I'm whining a little bit. Look what I did. I've been doing all kinds of projects here at the house. I feel like I'm all up in y'all's face. Arr! Let me back up a little bit. Here we go. Look what I did. I, my project today was to finish my door, my front door. And when you see the color, you're going to be like, whoa, that's a bright color. But our front door is meant to be, you know, the accent of the front of the house. So um, today I was putting on new locks, deadbolts, and um, a kick plate. So here it is. Y'all see it? I'll show you. Yep. I like the color. It looks good, like when the door's closed, because we just redid the landscaping in the front also, and uh, planted flowers, and we're getting flowers for the deck and stuff, so it looks good. So, uh, hope you are having a fantastic day. Peace.